you something. You'll die like this. What should we... Who's that? Uh, Dark Lord? Just a random guess? No. Doesn't look like it. Devious. The villagers said there was someone sick. Sorry to barge in. My name is Devious. I live in Jod. And you are Amanda? Oh, she's got a spear. I want the spear. Amanda, I have some medicine that will save him. Care to make a deal? You can save him? You can save Loki? Really? So, what, what kind of deal are we making this time? I don't, I don't understand what's going on. I'm sorry, Loki. That, what? I can't just let you die. Just when we hooked up again, I told you. I told you I knew what was going on here. Loki is exhausted. He's not, he's not injured. Oh, uh, Loki. We found Misa. Hey, she made it. You're all right. I'm so glad. That sounds sarcastic when you put that many O's. It does. Misa? Is that you, Misa? Yep, it's me. Sir Bogard was the one who rescued me. You're both okay. Great, but Siba and I got separated. Any news about him? He won't be done in so easily. More importantly, do you have the pendant? I've got it right. Oh, that's right. My clothes were scattered all over the room. I may never be able to find it again. It's gone! You don't think it was stolen, do you? Uh, probably not. There was a girl who came running out of this house just now. You mean Amanda? Nah, she wouldn't. I'll go find Amanda. <laughs> she probably would. She's trying to... She's trying to steal it and pawn it off, isn't she? Calm down a minute, Logie. Didn't this girl Amanda rescue you? Yeah, she was a slave. Always energetic and worried about her brother. Has a mouth on her, though. I'll check in town to see where Amanda went. And now we finally have control over just Logie. Bet you thought Misa was going to be joining us, but no. No. Everything will be fine. I bet a man just wanted to try on the pendant for fun. You know, around town. I'd want to try it on too, to see how it looked on me. There is a distinct lack of mirrors here, to be honest with you. Why not wait for the girl to come home? Or I could step out. And now we're in Mina's village. And there is a save point, which I will be using. Okay, now that we are in a new town with, well, there's a lot of buildings here, and apparently that's the end of town right there. Uh, we have quite a few side quests that we can at least start today. A lot of them we won't be able to finish. In fact, most of them we won't be able to finish. I believe there are six side quests in total that start here, and a couple that continue on here. Uh, so, let us talk to this Minos gentleman and glitch right through his head. Inside the village, dangers ahead abound whenever I go out of town and see monsters. I don't fight, I run. It's okay to be chicken. Surviving what's is what count. Look at that. That is so wrong. What is going on, kid? Man, as she ran towards Jod, she seemed kind of funny. What do you mean, she seemed kind of funny? What do you want about, kid? The man who fell out of the sky was carried over into Amanda's house. Something's not right. Something isn't right, I bet. So let's start going into the buildings. Uh, we do find the general store. Do you have anything new for me, Mote? Uh, anything for items? Anything good? Uh, we do have everything that... Um, well, er we do have at least one of everything that he sells. And To be honest, I'm not using items very often. Gumdrops are very rare for me to use. Uh, in terms of accessories, do you have any upgrades for us? You do! So I will actually purchase one. I'll get... Uh, the bandit, bandit earrings instead of the uh, cicada earrings. I think we've called them cicada before. It's because my bug knowledge is a little off. Cicada earrings. Now they are bandit earrings. Let's go ahead and put those on. Thank you very much. No, no, nobody gets that reference. But I don't care. It's an awesome reference. Uh, let's go ahead and put on... Wait. 
There we go. It's from the main screen. I always get that mixed up. Uh, put on the bandit earrings. Equip those! Hooray! Now agility is even more up. What is that little girl? Pancetta! You can really have the name Pancetta? You sound delicious. Well, well, hello, stranger. The name's Pancetta. I roam the globe in search of aerolite. Actually, the roaming part was a while ago. It's really more like waddling now. So are you supposed to be an old woman? It doesn't look like you are. Now, if by chance you have aerolite, I'd be happy to take it off your hands. And not for free. I would trade you something for it. And everything from treasures to trash. What do you think? A fine proposition, wouldn't you say? Yes, it is. Well, well, thank you, good buddy. Unfortunately, aerolite is a very rare um, material, whatever, for you to find. So this will probably not happen for me until very late in the game. There's, there's only eight places that you can get them in the entire game, and you have to be lucky, to be honest with you. Just you gotta be lucky, but I will be doing that. In my younger days, I could dance a jig with the best of them. So that's uh, one quest, by the way. What's up, Kurt? I I, I, I guess not. You know, once again, the slight layering is just a little weird. Maybe it's just uh, it's just the emulator and not the actual game, but that is strange. Hey, I I. You can't do that to me! How dare you! Fine, I'll talk to you people first before I loot you for all your worth. How do you do? I was wondering if you'd be willing to help me out. Sure! You see, my granddaughter has gone to Devious Manor on an internship, but we never see her. Do you think you could take this rhinolope to her for me? It's her favorite. Would you do an old woman a favor? Absolutely! How nice of you. Thank you very much. My daughter's name is Priscilla. Please give her my best. So we do have a new item. It's a fruit, I believe. Um, yeah, other items. Sometimes it's hard to remember all the subcategories here. Fruit. Rhinolope. It looks like a rhino, but it's a cantaloupe. So it's a rhinolope. You'll find a lot of puns like that in this game. A lot of puns. A lot of animal ones, too. The desert, eh? We spent our lives battling the desert. The people of Minos would have prospered more if not for the desert. So you're an adventurer. Can I ask a favor? Would you change the desert into forest for us? Notice I didn't have an option to say yes to that. Because that is not an actual quest. Heard that Amanda's brother was invited to Jod to sing. Interesting. Interesting. It is barbecued newt in my hand. Uh, yes. It's a first for me. Well, I'll be. Funny thing is, there used to be a guy here who loved the stuff. You know, seems like a small town to be looking for work in. They don't have jobs. He probably ended up over around Jod. Can't say for sure. So, we are still in search of Luke's father. He's no longer here. Just, ugh. I want, I want the treasure chest. I can't remember if I actually can get that, to be honest with you. But we do get Minos Bronze out of there. I, I, I want to say that there is a way. I want to say that there is a way that I can get that. But it just isn't occurring to me right now. But I'll be back. I'll probably be back for that. Uh, let's head over to this one before we start going into the end. To the blacksmith. What's up, little girl? The iron chemical smell coming from the blacksmiths really bothered. Well, then why are you here? Then leave. Yeah. What's a little girl doing in a blacksmith shop anyway? Get out. Welcome. Select weapon type, and then we could uh, make some stuff out of here. And uh, we could temper. Uh, he doesn't actually craft here. But they do temper. Come again. Delmar, do you know what spirit coins are? Uh, what if I say, actually, yeah, I know what those are. Of course you do, every adventurer does. But I have to say, I've never met anyone who's had a complete set of coins. If you can collect all of them, I'll give you a prize. So, if we manage to get all eight of the trait coins, at least one of each, he will give us a prize. Uh, once again, that's not going to be something that I can complete uh, just yet. 
just yet at all. No matter where you go from here, you gotta go through the desert. It's wicked tired. What accent was I supposed to be going for? Was that, like, Boston? What? Wicked Boston. I, I got nothing. What's up, guy? Hey, yo, timing couldn't be better. Word has it that monsters here sometimes drop glittering armor. I could really use that armor to apply for the castle job. If you get some, would you sell it? I'd give you 200 lucre for it. Yes, so I do need to go uh, grind for some glittering armor since I don't have it. Uh, much better than the stuff you have on now, dick. It's useless. I hope you know that. It's just plain useless. So the glittering armor, uh, we yeah, we need to go find, because I don't have it just yet. Luckily, it is not too far away. This is going to be one of the quests that we can actually do relatively shortly. Uh, just not right now, because I'm busy in the inn. How you doing? There's three kinds of... Right, slash, bash, and jab. So I'm using more. Blah, 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 one kind than another. But an easier time of it if you can learn a foe's weakness. I could look at the B share and memorize that, but that'd be... That'd be tough, actually. There's something called the Altar of Time that was built by the Mavels. Of course, no rumor in any RPG is ever true. Those are always fake. What's up, Toma? I haven't seen you around before. My na the name's Toma. I look just like Vega. Don't bother to remember it. I'll be dead soon. <laughs> How awesome of him to say. Just like, hi, my name is Toma. Don't worry about me, I'll be dead tomorrow, so don't bother remembering my name. How nice of you to say. Great timing! You've got to listen to him. You have to, it might take him forever, but... Uh, how you doing, Tony? No, really, his idea is great. You could score big time. I mean, I don't get it all myself, but hey, what do you know? You'll get a piece of the action, too. Sure, I'll listen to him. This is actually a side quest, believe it or not. Uh, that's why they give you the yes or no option. So, yes! Thanks, we're counting on you. Kids nowadays, I could take that punk. What a disgrace. You ought to stand up for yourself. You think it's okay for him to pull that? I could take you too. But never mind that. You're all right, kid. Now, listen up. Don't look so worried. This won't take long, but it's important. Keep it on the QT. What the hell's the QT? They're putting the squeeze on the mana believers around here. What's so bad about believing anyway? Never thought about it. Me? Yeah, I thought about it. But I ain't sure yet. Believing ain't bad. But keep it down. The walls have ears. I ain't living in no place run by any stinking realm soldiers. The way I see it tonight, the goddess is just like being jealous of your mother. And your pals are happy believing in the goddess. Problem is, I ain't happy. Now, what's up with that? Is mana goddess not fair or what? How come only believers get to be happy? If only believers get to be happy, what about the others? They're left miserable? The non-believers have to be the heretics, right? That's why some of my pals ended up hating the goddess. And what about this whole idea of being happy or unhappy? I mean, what's happy? Take a look at people who believe. Are they all rich? Are they all living the high life? They're not, right? No, they got more than their share of heartaches in life. On the other hand, unbelievers get rich, even kill each other. They ain't got this, but when they get it, they want something else. All they do is beef about what they want and don't have. I'll show those realm soldiers. You're with me on this, right? Of course you are. By the way, have you been paying attention to everything I said? You bet I have! First listen, then think about it. Next, it's time to take some action. If you don't, you ain't no better than Realm Soldiers. If you're like them, I'll take you out. And that goes for the Realm Soldiers boss, Dark Lord, too. I'll take him out. And those chicken mana believers, I'll take them all out. We heard that there are mana believers here. Just hand them over nice and quiet. Just in time, we'll go together. Take me to see Dark Lord. I'll give him a piece of my mind. That is actually spelled right. Most people for put that as the other way. I got to get this off my chest. What you're doing makes no sense. I don't get it at all. I'd like to smack the goddess myself. What did she make a world like this for? Okay, okay, we get the point. <laughs> God, he's like every high guy I've ever met. What's up, Johnny? Whoa, what a disaster. You can have this. I don't know what it's for, but it's pretty, don't you think? And we receive a dead bear's gold. Once again, I don't know what it's for. Well, you know, I do, but 
they haven't told us yet. So we did get a Dead Bear's Gold, and that's how you complete that side quest. Yes, that was the side quest. You just have to lie and say that you paid attention. Hell, even as I was reading it, I'm going, good lord, what the hell is he on about? So that looks like that's it for the inn. And now we can head up here to the last room. We can talk to everybody here. Did you find that Amanda girl? No, I didn't find her. It seems she's headed for Jod. Jod, eh? It's too far to be going for just a stroll. We better get to Jod. You two go on ahead to Jod without me. I'll catch up with you after I leave a note for Amanda. Everything will be fine. I bet Amanda just wanted to try on the pendant for fun. You keep telling yourself that, Misa. I mean, I'd want to try it on too to see how it looked on me. Haven't we heard this before? Alrighty, we'll get a head start to John. Let's get going, Misa. Sure. Okay. Be careful, Loki. See you in John. Everything will be fine, I swear. So. I didn't write the note. Can I just leave? I can just leave. And that actually looks like it's going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Sword of Mana. I've been Bala Scoop. I've been joined, as always, by Loki. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.